Hi, welcome to the next assembly video for the RepRap Prusa i3. In this video, we're going to install the X carriage and um, the belt for the X carriage. So this is the X carriage. And um, you'll notice these are the bearing holders here, here, and here. So start by putting those in place. So these will be assembled with the 25 millimeter M3s. <clears throat> with uh, M3 lock nuts. Oh yeah, that's why I wanted to install it anyway. <clears throat> Sorry about that, I was wearing a sweatshirt and I forgot that these lights get really hot. Notice how with these loose, the whole X carriage wobbles a little bit. So our goal here is to tighten these to a, to a point where it doesn't wobble. Try not to rest your body weight on these bolts as you're tightening them.
That feels good. <clears throat> it's not uh, wobbling and it still moves fairly smooth. It doesn't really move on its own, but it hardly takes any any pressure to move it at all. So that should be perfect. Okay, let's get the belt. Okay, I'm gonna have to flip this around so you can see this. Okay. Um. <laughs> Oops. Okay. So now I have it, um, going around the idler bearing on this side and around the pulley on this side. So flip it back around. And now we can secure it in here. Try to give you a better view. Okay, there's slots in here on both sides, so I'm going to try to roll this into a little bit of a ball. Slide it in. That didn't work, but um, I can use an Allen key to sort of push it down. Okay, you can see it passing through here maybe. Secure that with a zip tie. And then snip the excess of that off. This side. And secure that side with a zip tie.
And then just check the pulley and the bearing to make sure that they're lined up right. I'll go ahead and flip it around and check. Looks good here. And it looks good here too. Okay. Now I can go ahead and snip off the excess um, belt. Leave a little bit on there on that side. And uh, try to clip quite a bit of this side off here. As this side goes back this way, it's going to try to feed into the uh, idler, but that should be fine right there. <clears throat> okay, now you can tighten it right over here. The M4 bolt. That feels good. And whenever this gets loose, you can just retighten it. That is working out great. Okay. <clears throat> In the next video, we'll do the um, uh, the extruder, and then we'll get the extruder mounted to the X carriage. But uh, it's really coming together. There's a bunch to do now. Thanks for watching. Hope you're having fun. See you next time.